What's up fellow travelers, my name is Brian and welcome to my channel where I present travel tips, tricks and vlogs on a weekly basis. In the previous episode, I spent a full day in the city of Montreal, Canada where I showed you guys how you can enjoy nature in this urban jungle. If you guys haven't had a chance to check out that video, I'll link it down below in the description. Today, I am back in the amazing city of Montreal to showcase its art scene. Montreal is known internationally for its urban art, its street art, and especially its arts murals. And we're going to give you just a little taste of what you'll find here in this beautiful city. So with that, let's just jump right into it, shall we? We are being our amazing day here in Montreal by doing a self-guided art mural tour in the Latin quarters of Montreal. More specifically by using a free app called Portressanal. Unfortunately it's a French app but it, you can still use the uh, map in the app to locate the different murals in the city. I'll put that all the information down below in the description. So with that, let's hit the Latin quarters and let's check out these amazing murals. Alright guys, now that we're done in the Latin Quarters, we are now in the Plateau Mont-Royal district. The Latin Quarters is obviously breathtaking, the architecture is amazing, the art murals are great, and also because of the pandemic, certain streets like Saint-Denis are closed off to uh, vehicles, so it's a lot calmer and it allows you to have more open space to walk. The Plateau Mont-Royal district is obviously known for its art murals because every single year there's a festival called Festival de Mural which goes on and creates these massive murals. So we're going to check them out and on the way we're going to head to my land and get an amazing bite to eat there. I know a secret spot that where you can get a bagel, some gnocchi and also a good ice cream right beside each other. So with that, let's hit the street. We've been walking out for over 30 minutes and to be honest, this part of the city is absolutely beautiful. And because the art pieces were created during the Festival of Mural, the art pieces are much bigger on the walls. And this part of the city is absolutely breathtaking. The urban infrastructure is really beautiful and like I said earlier, a lot of streets are closed to road traffic, so it's really peaceful and tranquil. Anyways, let's head to the mile end and get to bite eat. Alright guys, after arriving in the Mile End, we went and got some amazing ice cream here at Kem Kuba. It is without a doubt one of the best ice creams I've ever had in my life. And I'm not even exaggerating, no joke, I would be willing to just go camp right in front of it and just have ice cream all day. It is that good. Um, actually, and right beside Kem Kuba, um, the ice cream shop, you have two other places that are really interesting. You have a place that sells uh, yaki, homemade fresh yaki, and also Fairmount bagels. And for those that don't know, Montreal is known internationally for their bagels, just like New York. Um, I'll let you guys go figure out online why, but it's because of the type of oil they cook in. So with that, we're now going to head all the way to the Museum of Country Arts in downtown Montreal, do a quick visit, and after that we're going to get dinner with some friends. So with that, let's hit the metro. That is so good. <laughs> without doubt one of the best bagels I ever had in my life. I got the two garni, so the all season bagels. I also got some salmon dip, which is so good. I mean, this with the ice cream, I'm just in flavor heaven right now. I'm so, I'm just so happy. 
I'm not ready for a museum tour. Right, guys after having an amazing time in the mile end and let's be honest I ate like a pig the ice cream was totally good that bagel is without a doubt one of the best bagels I've had in my life and we are now here in Thess des Halles, where we just visited the Museum of Country Arts and to be honest it was absolutely fantastic for only five dollars for students and here's the regular price for adults in my opinion what you get during the pandemic is totally worth visiting the museum all in all, today was absolutely a fantastic day. Whether it be the different self-guided art mural tours we did, it's just to show you that you don't need to spend tons of money to discover the art scene here in Montreal. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video, and if you did, hit subscribe button down below for more travel tips, tricks, and vlogs on a weekly basis. With that, guys, I'll see you next Sunday at 11 a.m. for all new travel episode. Don't forget, guys, safe travels.